what's good, y'all? What's going on? It's Corner Sports Day. Do not forget to subscribe, like, share, and comment. Look, after watching like eight hours of sports today, North Carolina State beat Duke, who was favorite. North Carolina State, they got 14 losses, and they're headed to the Final Four. Now, nobody on this planet, now I can't say that, but most people do not have North Carolina State going to the Final Four. They barely made the tournament to begin with. They was not favored in none of the games they played within the tournament. Like I said, the only people that thought they was going to the Final Four was North Carolina State players and their parents and their grandparents and their guardians. Nobody had a 14-loss team going to the going to the final four. The bookmakers, the bookies, the odds makers, Las Vegas, no one had North Carolina State going to the final four. But it's called March Madness for a reason. Because anything can happen. Lower seed teams beat higher ranked teams all the time. Like you're talking about 11th seed. North Carolina State was 11th seed. Now they're going to play Purdue for, for a chance to go to the finals. You can't make this up. You talk about Cinderella. But like I said, they call it March Manage for a reason. Anything can happen. Also, North Carolina State's women's team is in the Final Four. So how many times do you see the men's team and the women's team in the Final Four. Now, I don't know what happened before, but it don't happen that often. Now, I hope y'all Easter Sunday was as good as mine. I enjoyed some family members that was over. I enjoyed some cabbage, some macaroni and cheese, some gravy with rice. Able to see my mother, able to see a bunch of loved ones. I had a beautiful Easter, Easter Sunday. Now, when North Carolina State plays Purdue, they're not going to be favored to win. Do I think they're going to beat Purdue? No. No. Zach Eady, I think, is too tough. I think their starting five is better than North Carolina State's starting five. But you never know. I mean, North Carolina State, I mean, with all the momentum they got, and they're playing great basketball, if they beat Purdue, I wouldn't be overly shocked because they're playing great basketball. But I just think Purdue's going to win the game. Now, I said early in the video before that I got UConn winning the whole thing. I got UConn winning the whole thing because they look unbeatable. But as much madness, anything can happen. But please, don't beat me in the head telling me or leaving comments thinking that y'all thought North Carolina State was going to make it to the Final Four because y'all be lying. Now, before I go, shout out to DJ Burns Jr., he averaged like 12, what, 13 points on the season, but he's been dominating everybody in the tournament. He's been destroying guys in the tournament in the paint. So shout out to him. And he's picked up a bunch of NIL deals over the last two weeks. So congratulations to him. He's getting a bag full of endorsements. He's making some money. And he's dominating March Madness. Now, I'm rooting for them against Purdue, but if they play Connecticut in the finals, you know, with my East Coast bias, when it comes to basketball, I'm rooting for UConn. Look, you guys leave comments. I'll let y'all guys later.